Hey everybody, so we got a quick unboxing and information video to do. This is the last item that I got from Amazon that was um, not this order, but the last order before that. When I did the video, you guys might recall of the um, chargers, the Optima chargers, and this is the other item that I was waiting for. I bought three different uh, maintainers and chargers. Two showed up, this one just showed up. Please stick around, check out the video, and I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. Hey everybody, so this is that Schumacher rapid charger and maintainer that um, didn't show up with the Optima battery chargers that I ordered. The box is really smashed. Um, I'm not sure if it's damaged or not, but it's bulging on all sides. I'm wondering if this might have been a return or something. Guess we'll find out. This is... Uh, model number SC1280. So Sam Charlie 1280. Um, it is a fully automatic, fast, safe, smarter, microprocess controlled, reverse hookup protection, LED indicators, start stop interface, digital display. Auto voltage detection automatically selects charge rate for charging and maintaining. For automotive and marine batteries, battery charger, maximize energy efficiency rated for 800 cold crank amps. Ideal for marine batteries, standard AGM gel and deep cycle, 6 volt and 12 volt. Uh, Microprocess controlled, LED display indicates button controls, charges compatible battery type 6 and 12 volts, standard DGM gel, deep cycle batteries, auto voltage detection, automatically tech 6 or 12 volt batteries, reverse hookup protection, charger will not operate if clamps are reversed, connect it and forget it all season long, monitors and maintains the battery when fully charged, resumes continuous charging when battery becomes discharged. SCHU Eco Energy. It basically says that all the way around the box. Schumacher Electrical Corporation prides itself on being an industrial leader in providing safe, affordable, reliable, energy efficient products. Wow, there is, um. I wonder if this item was used. Return. It seems a little weird to me. Usually there would be packing in this box. Schumacher is always great about packing. There's like no packing in this box. There's a rip in this bottom, this very bottom corner. There's a rip on that side. And these would have been wrapped. Look at this. These cables would have actually been wrapped. Technically, they would not have been bundled like this. They would have actually been wrapped. That's um that's very odd. Let's grab the cable, see if it turns on. Turns on. These styles should also have a, a protection where if you touch them together, they won't spark. Yep. You can turn these lights off so it's a little easier to see. So this one is like the other Schumacher I have. This is just a 3 amp. The other one I have is a 2 amp and a 6 amp maintainer. This one's just a 3 amp maintainer. This one does 6 and 12 volts just like the other one I have, but this one does a 15 amp rapid charge. Um, you 
seems a little loud to me. I might have to contact Amazon and make sure that they you know, that let them know that the package is definitely damaged. Because um, the last time I bought a Schumacher item from Amazon, it was literally sent in a brown Amazon box. And then I had to take the main box out. Um, it does have the instructions and everything. Uh, this is not a, a huge video. I, I have a crap ton of um, battery videos coming out before this one. This is an unboxing. We will definitely test it on a battery. Um, I'm still messing with that other battery as well. I had the had the battery on this big Optima 1200 12 amp charger for about a week and a half now. Um, the battery now, when I unhook it from, because it's now charged into the, the slower battery, which is saying there's a, a bad a problem. Unable to charge check battery. So now that's flashing. So this charger and that charger have done that. This charger um, said check battery multiple times. That charger is the first time it's done that. I just unhook the clamps. Um, but this charger did get this battery up to the point where it now, um, when I test it, it holds 14.4 volts just by testing it straight from the posts. Um, plug this back on. And I will do more videos on it to show you guys. That way you guys get to see it. Um, I've used that one, the 1200 or the 12 amp. That's the, you know, that's why it's a 1200 model. Use it for almost two weeks or so on and off, unhooking it from the battery, trying to recover this battery. Um, and this is the first time that the four amp or 400 model has told me that there was a battery issue. Now, if I do a pre-charge battery status, it says 13 volts, so the 100% charge. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell it to do auto and marine again. It's gonna analyze the battery for like 15, 20 minutes and then it will start charging. Um, but I'm gonna, I did the 12 amp uh, Optima charger um, for two weeks, unhooked it three times in those two weeks. Now the battery's holding a good voltage. Um, and now we're just trying to recover the ampage, but the might have been too much sulfation in the plates and it might be just dead. It might only be putting out one third of, or one eighth of the percentage of the battery. You know, and it is what it is. You know, if, if you gotta buy another $200 battery, it is what it is, at least you know, you give it a shot, but there's other factors involved on why that bi battery might be bad. By the time I got to it, when I found that there was a um, parasitic draw, um, you know, it could have been two, three weeks and I didn't realize it was it was dead. I just went to o open the truck and lights didn't come on, nothing worked. I'm like, really? So, you know, it, it, I swear up and down it was only about a, a less than a week it was only about three or four days when after i found out a parasitic draw but you know i could have gotten really busy a lot of clients a lot of uh service calls and i just spaced it my kids or my wife you know you know we i could have spaced it because of my kids or my wife or anything else so you know it's a possibility that it wasn't three days it was actually three weeks or a month or a month and a half but um if i can't recover it hey you know I have the chargers and maintainers for other things. Not a big deal, I'll just buy another battery. But you can't say we didn't give it the old college try. But um, we'll, we'll test this one on it as well. You know, can't go anything wrong. The batteries, it, the battery's not superheating or anything. So it's, it's not like it's, a, it's dangerous to charge it. Um, but I appreciate your guys' time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, we'll do testing and, and check out videos on this. Please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, go check out or uh, go hit the bell notification icon for uh, future updates. 
please go check out my Amazon affiliate links, my Acme Tools affiliate links, my DJI Electronics affiliate links, as well as my Ohio Power Tools affiliate links down in the description below. Hopefully this video was uh, entertaining or helpful or maybe something you guys want to see in the future. Um, I will be doing more videos on it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace!